So 2% of park guests say this park was amazing and I don't want to leave. 5% say security is great. 20% say there are good and bad things about this park. And 67% say I am so unhappy I am on my way home. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Common Turismo World. And um, first off, I forgot how loud this place is. <laughs> okay, so a few things have changed. There was a entire episode that I filmed that I stopped playing trying to find... Trying to find a quiet place in this park that I can actually talk for a second. So I did film a whole different episode, and that episode did not ever get edited. So I didn't want to go back and actually do it, because it was quite a while ago that I made it. So I just wanted to jump in with new footage now. So before I show you guys the rest of the park, uh, the frame rate has been struggling. It's been chugging, chugging along. So I'm going to try and hopefully get around it. Like over here, it, it's decently okay. But uh, the one of the attractions that I did build is uh is quite problematic all right so this as you may recognize is our entrance and i don't think a whole ton has changed but um what has changed is 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 this ride right here so let's just say this thing is fairly resource intensive so this ride here uh as you can see from the entrance is a uh, mad vlad slav tours and it's quite popular it's backed up all the way to the entrance <laughs> but uh just to show you what this place looks like i actually kind of went uh a little crazy here. I mean, it's it's nothing like uh, what Planet Coaster YouTubers would do, but it's definitely not light on the theming. Plus, it's got like little events here and there. Like, look, there's a truck right there that's that's out. There's a plane here with this dude just like stranded on it. See, look, they're just here and this guy's just like, please save me. And they're just like, nope. And then my personal favorite part of this is the train that almost hits everybody and also almost breaks my computer, it seems. But I imagine that would be a pretty terrifying effect, to be honest. <laughs> you just round this corner and all of a sudden this train just launches at you. Uh, and then we have the labor camp. And uh, that's actually a, a, a park actor. Uh, she's thrilled to be here. So yeah, then there's like this little bit that I didn't know what to do with, so I just put another crashed boat that says turn back. And then uh, then you just go through this weird temple that has absolutely nothing to do with the park at all. So the next thing I did was build a park figurehead. So now, now you go through the gates and you walk out through the smoke into the town and lo and behold, we have a thing. <laughs> so this is now the park icon. <laughs> it's just here. It serves no purpose. It, it has an information booth over here and then a gumball machine, which the most profitable shop slash facility in the whole park. <laughs> it's that one gumball machine right there. So yeah, this is this is kind of where we're at. Uh, a lot more to do. Uh, I'm ti not entirely sure what I want to do next. I feel like I've kind of set the bar for theming with this ride and and the and the centerpiece and now I just feel obligated to keep it going. <laughs> it would be nice if I didn't put a giant mountain here, though. I, I could have probably used a bit more foresight on the actual placement of things. Plus, you kind of just leave this, like, Pripyat little area, and then you're just right here in this, like, Jungle Cruise-type place. So, I mean, yeah, there's a bit of a tonal shift going on here. Oh, I remember there was one thing I wanted to do. Uh, uh just keep scrolling. Yeah, there they are. There's tanks. <laughs> I hope for the guest's sake that it doesn't actually fire anything because people on the bumper cars are going to get a nasty surprise. Also, I realize now that I went with the Cyrillic style on the word Metro and then just went outright for Pripyat. You know what? I think it's fine. But man, what should I build today? You know what? I think I might put another strip of Pripyat buildings right there. What kind of ride would go here? Again, here I am overthinking everything. What is this? This is just a prefab. Tower of Terror ride. Ooh. Pripyat Tower of Terror. Alright, I'm thinking... Right here is where we put our tower. You know, I think this whole front side of the park here is going to be the city. So this whole section here is going to be city-based. This wall, divide that out. And then, um... I don't even know what I'm doing with the rest of this. Maybe this part will be like a display show for Common Turismo. Uh, possibly. Speaking of which, and I know I'm getting distracted here, but... Could I make a tiny little common trees amount of parts here? I, 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 I'm not happy with this. I'm done working on this for now. All right, on to the good stuff. This is going to be the crappiest Tower of Terror ride ever made. Also, it seems that I'm going to need to raise the height of this building just a bit. 
Oh my gosh, this music is getting beyond repetitive. Okay, so what I think the ride pattern is, is it stops there, it goes this way, and then, can I sequence this thing at all, or? Okay, I can sequence it, slightly. Okay, so let's see what it does. So, it should go that way. It's not going that way. It's It went the exact opposite way. All right, I am just really not good at this. Then it moves forward. <laughs> it's getting suspenseful. Then it goes up. Just one floor. Then it goes down. How many did it go down? Almost, holy crap, how many stops does this thing have? This is a lot of things I'm gonna have to build for it. Then it goes to the very bottom. I've already lost track. Is that the end? Okay, that's the end. All right, so there's a lot going on. Okay, so I got my work cut out for me. Uh, first things first, this building needs to be a little wider for this. That looks actually kind of normal. I mean, it's not symmetrical anymore, with, which actually bothers me quite substantially, but it works. You know, in fact, I'm just going to pause the whole park while we're doing this so I can have more frames and... Uh, not have to listen to that music any longer. You know what guys, I am just gonna go ahead and time lapse this whole bit because this is gonna get repetitive very quickly. Alright guys, so I am not going to be able to finish this in a reasonable time. I kind of got a little overly ambitious. So, um, yeah. Let me know if you guys want to see the rest of this ride come together over a time lapse or if you just want me to do it off camera and then just do a ride through. Because this is getting intense. Alright, let's uh, actually, let's uh, ride through that first scene. It's not all set up yet, so it's not going to work exactly right. But... You can kind of get the, get the idea of it. But yeah, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one.